Okay, this is a supplementary video to the installation of the ConNav unit. Um, sometimes it's not going to be possible for you to run the Ethernet cable required to get the internet connected to the ConNav unit. So you can alternatively purchase from us a Wi-Fi dongle. Uh, the Wi-Fi dongle will come with a ready-made power lead ready to wire into your alarm panel um, and an Ethernet cable attached to go in your ConNav. Quite a simple setup. So basically once you wire the power lead in, you'll plug that together and then you'll simply plug in the RJ45 socket into the ConNav unit. So when you're mounting this, you'll need to do one of your knockouts because you'll need to mount the dongle outside the box. If you put the dongle in the box, you won't get Wi-Fi reception and it won't work properly. So there's plenty of places where you can do the knockout, mount the unit on the outside of the box. This dongle does require some setting up, so we're going to take you through that process that this part's easy, installation of it onto here, but there are a few more steps um, which we'll need to do. One of the things that you will need is you will need your Wi-Fi password, so you'll need to um, write it down, make sure you've got that handy when we get to that step. Okay, this next part that we're going to actually now set up the Wi-Fi dongle. So go into your, um, you can use an iPhone or your, um, uh, any wireless device, go into your wireless networks and what we're looking for is a Vonex connection. This Vonex connection is our actually dongle. So what we do is we tap on that and we want to connect to that. So we basically want to make a connection from this device to that. So you'll see it there trying to make the connection. There will be a detailed um, PDF basically taking you through step by step of doing this, the wireless setup because there is a few codes and things to remember, um, which I don't think you might remember from the uh, video. You'll notice this usually pops up and says no internet connection because the basically it can see that there's a Wi-Fi connection there but it can't see the internet. Um, if you just give it a little bit of time, it'll eventually connect. So now it's connected. It can take a couple of minutes sometimes to connect. That's fine. Now you're connected to that. What we do then is go out of that settings and go into um, something like Safari. Um, if it, it will ask you for a password when you connect, and it's just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and that'll be in the document anyway. So basically, when you go into Safari, um, just open a new page. And what we're going to do, we're going to type in here. Um, an IP address and the IP address is for the for the Wi-Fi dongle. So we want to type in 192 uh, dot um, 168 dot 254 dot 254 254 there we go okay what this will do is this will connect this to the actual device so we can actually set it up. So this is where you're going to need to have your Wi-Fi um, password ready. So you can see we're connecting to the dongle. There we are. The default uh, login is admin. And the password is admin as well, all lowercase. Okay, so what you'll see now is you've got a couple of different um, um, options. Okay, so scan hotspots, so we just see. So, so now we've found a list of Wi-Fi hotspots. Select the Wi-Fi hotspot you want to use. Slide along and hit the next button. Now it will ask you for the um, password for the for the hotspot. So type in your Wi-Fi password. Once you've typed your Wi-Fi password in, um, you can just go down to um, apply, and then reboot, and then this, then the dongle will then connect to your Wi-Fi hotspot, and that should provide you an internet connection to your ConNav card. So basically, you can then start doing the programming as we pick it up from the previous video um, of the Ethernet programming. But all the details of this will be in a document that will come with your um, Wi-Fi dongle to basically help you through the process. Quite simple. You'll also notice here that the dongle will actually also double as a repeater. Um, you can turn that feature off if you don't require it. Okay, so now you've got your Wi-Fi hotspot connected, um, your Wi-Fi dongle. Now you can basically get to the same point you would have been in the previous video with the Ethernet cable where you can actually log into the ConNav, 
and start doing the programming. So it's all exactly the same. All the hotspot does, all the Wi-Fi dongle does, is give you an internet connection in lieu of having a Ethernet cable running to it. So if it's a two-story house and you can't possibly get the cable downstairs, that's why you would have chosen to use the Wi-Fi dongle. So basically from this point on, follow the other video and everything will just run through. Again, thanks for watching. Hope this has been helpful and there will be a document with some details supplied with the dongle. Thank you.